It is a great day, shifting gears, to take the kids or the grandkids to the park. And there is a free one in South County that has a few new additions. Our Paige Holsey joins us live for our new Great Day for Kids series. Paige? Ooh. Speaking of kids, <laughs> look at this little kid. How precious is this sweet girl? I would tell you her name, but she doesn't even have one yet. She's that new. She was just born in the last week here at Susan Park in South County. This park free and open to the public. It's a county park, so you can bring the kids and come meet these guys as well as many other farm animals here. And Emma Burns joins us. She's a professional goat wrangler. No, she, really, she's one of the caretakers here at the park. You have another friend with you. Who is that? Yeah, this is Queso. Queso. He's a little boy. So Queso and the one that I have, they are both part of the new crew, right? You have several new babies here. Yes, we actually had six goat, goat kids born this year. Um, they are uh, half siblings. They have the same father. Different mothers, that's why they look so different. And they do have different uh, ear styles. Yes, as well, speaking of that, I just learned something new. Tell me about the different breeds that you have here and how you can identify them. We have three different breeds here at Susan of goats. Uh, this little guy is a La Mancha goat. They have these small little goblin ears. <laughs> he has the same ears as his mother, Millie. Now, this little baby has these longer floppy ears. She has similar ears to her mother, Cher. Cher is a Nubian goat. And then we also have Nigerian dwarf goats that have those sideways airplane sure. ears. Sure. And you, kids, anyone can come interact with the goats or the other animals, right? Tell us about what you have to offer as far as that goes. Yes, yeah, so we have tons of animals here at Susan for people to come and meet up close and feed and pet and handle. We do behind the barn tours a couple times a month on Fridays where you get to come up close with the animals, you get to feed them and have a little bit more personalized of, uh, of an experience. Um, but yeah, lots of great opportunities to get kids introduced to animals from a very early age. Yeah, and the park is now open, so we're starting to see some families come in and feed these goats. And like I said, it's free. It's a county park. So they have the animals, they have a playground, they have a fishing pond, trails here, so much to offer, and also some educational experiences as well. So coming up, we're going to go to a brand new interactive exhibit and show you what that is all about. But for now, I'm live with my new friends here at Susan Park in South County. Too fun. I Thank you, love Paige. It. All the cuteness meters back in the control yes. room just broke. They just mm -hmm. exploded. We'll check oh. in uh, with you again in a little bit. In the 